games and theme songs. The Union Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space uh -huh. exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited on. funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Big boy technology. Welcome everyone, Ewok Templar, Doom 3. Incoming transport detected. It's been a long time since I've played this one. This has to be way more than a decade, it might be. Mars approach, Dark Star with U07063, passing through 38,000. Roger, Dark Star, descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that tower. We have them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. See that Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Remember, I have the like, strategy yes, guide book for this game. And I don't remember where it is. Sour, Dark sure Star on final. Maybe next episode. We've got you, Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. Ministry of Supplies. You can read everything. Container 1 classified. Container 2 classified. Container 3 classified. Four small GS crates. Health warning. Grab seal crates contain biological specimens. Do not open. Alright. More biological specimens. Inbound. Whole different list. Outbound. Never knew that. There was just a little tutorial for you how to use this thing. I this tripped me out the first time I played the game. Having these like interactive council, like these little council pads, and they they're actually just floating in the world, and you just push them. Welcome to Mars. All new arrivals need to check in at reception. You check in at reception. Oh, actually, hold on. I like having a high turning speed, but this might be the first time in a game where my turning speed is actually just a little too high. Oh god, that ship's gonna crush us. Help us. Hold on, here we go. Game controls. Let's turn it down just a little bit. What about right there? Uh, uh, uh. System. No, I don't see an option. Oh, would it be underneath advanced options? I'm not gonna mess with any of the graphics, everything's fine. Video settings, audio settings. This is it, this is the audio settings that you get. So, whatever. Resume. Hm. See how much I have to move to turn around completely. Huh? Huh? I still go over a little bit, that's fine. Welcome to Mars City. This is way more Union manageable. Aerospace's premier research facility. Here. To expedite your processing, please proceed one. directly to reception. You should too. <laughs> this one smart guy in the entire facility, he's leaving. I can get my fist out though. 
Key towels. Clothes. I can just delete things. <laughs> what happens if I delete everything? I know this is important. I'm, I'm working for them. It has been made to alter a classified shipping. You gotta have proper security clearance to perform this operation. Oh, okay, fine. To all those details. Oh, see, they're classified. I'm not allowed to delete those. I could delete everything else, though. I like that. It's nice. It's nice. Real nice. God, this is a dark game. Maybe the rest of the other games have given the invitation. Welcome to Mars, Marine. Hi. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bio scan. This will only take a second. Okay, let me get this started. Does it say that I'm human? Still, moving around only makes the test take longer. All right, bioscan looks good. You're cleared for entry. This reminds me of a way cleaner looking Quake 4. On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City. This facility serves as the central hub for all scientific research, Attention. archaeological Director study, Banks. and military Please report operations. to Central Administration. Goal number one at the UAC is the oh, safety is and well-being of all employees and guests. To help achieve this goal, we ask you to follow all UAC <laughs> corporate procedures at all times. This includes restricting your movement to areas we'll where you have players, very short person. Always remain alert and aware of what you and others are doing. If you notice anything out of the ordinary, or just have a simple question, Fire. Oh. I'm the nearest UAC security guard. They are here to help, no matter how large or small the problem is. Our station on Mars provides a perfect blend of work habitat. You notice three days sitting around that somehow fire appears between them. All. Structures. This ensures our goal of providing a true home away from home experience for everyone. They're planning on terraforming this it, by the way. As you help us pursue our groundbreaking research that is destined to transform the daily lives of everyone here and throughout the solar system. A green, white if you need rock more detailed moths. assistance, please see your human resources manager. Like if you the are hills a guest, of Dover. you may bring up any issue with your appointed UAC liaison. Thank you, and have a nice day. I love it. Oh my god, the departure schedule, it's all here. My green guns and nachos, the magazine. Hey, can I get some, uh, Robocola? No? Come on guys, we'll be this way. November Safety Awareness Month on Mars, and the UAC uh, has scheduled a variety of workshops to help promote a safer working environment for everyone. Download now to learn more. Error processing PDA. Oh, I don't have a PDA yet. Oh, I wonder if they come back. Those little drones. Remind me of Mem Knights from Magic the Gathering. These little guys. Machine gun heads. Restricted. Come on. <laughs> ah. Have to Welcome hold down to shift to run. Uh -huh. time, you can just leave your bag there. I'll have it sent up your quarters. In the okay. meantime, there's a few things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. An if you get clearance tab, for any security tablet, zones, it it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I'm losing it immediately, sir. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. It's just that way. Follow the signs. Ah. The PDA is critical for your work. It does a lot of stuff. Okay. Current mission objectives, a lot of nothing. Name, player. Oh, I can't read my thing. It just says player. Inbox of player. Welcome to Mars Marine. I'd like to take a brief moment of your time to welcome you to what we call our home away from home. We will make a, every effort. Da, 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 da. Oh, God, this goes on. Pleasant as possible, you need something, please feel free to contact your supervisor for immediate assistance. I hope that you will find the time to take advantage of some of our great staff amenities. As a reminder, we engage in technical, highly secure testing and research here. Please refrain from wandering into unauthorized areas. Any security team member will assist you if you help is needed. Sincerely, Dr. William Banks. Report to Marine Command as soon as possible. But don't waste time touching things, Sergeant Kelly. You touch boy. God, you're weird, right? 
the tab button. But now I can come back here. Give me. Nice. Okay. And now, here we go. Safety committee. Safety awareness month. Hey, what can I buy you? Review all the standard protocols, man. Mandatory this scheduled time to attend in each of these are valuable. Can I use page? No, I can't. Proper plasma handling, that's one of the things we're going to go over there. Emergency first aid, got to learn that. Storage of weapons and ammo, emergency loss of environment, see postings outside your headquarters. Dude, bro. Alright, let's go. You better move along. It looks like you've got some important things to do. We're going to swing it the in. The last there. Marine that kept the sergeant waiting was permanently assigned to guard duty at the solid waste facility. <laughs> better move. Some people say I'm kind of a solid waste guy. I need to find the card for, what is this? Uh, ACO access card, Union Aerospace Marine, okay, area locked. Mars City is a smoke-free facility. Come on. Please smoke only in designated areas. No Thank smoke. You for your cooperation. I got a video desk. Oh. I think he's always mad at me. Actually, I think there is a thing to where if you get there in time, he's actually not that mad. I'm here because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? I also have no, one eye and obviously but I'm not evil. authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money. Some product. Don't worry. They don't care about demons. They'll get their product. Hell. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked, complaining, requesting transfers off Mars? It's probably the devil. They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a <laughs> they have two eyes, like staff, a week to. bigger budget, even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I this will need full access, Dr. Vitruger, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Hmm. Let's go. Everyone here has a grimace on their face if they're not wearing a helmet. They're just all like... <laughs> Hey, can I have Listen, some? buddy, you don't have clearance for this area. Move along. Can I have that machine gun? Come on, dude. Give me some clearance. Just ask for some. Bro, can I have some clearance? Excuse me. Oh, hey. Pardon me, T. Washington. What magazines you got here? Some booty. And Game Hog. I like both those things. Wow, this is a dark bathroom. Oh my god, ray tracing. In the past. I'll have to keep my fist up. Just being ready. Yeah, so those suits arrived too. Weird. The UAC must be worried about something. I hear there's been more accidents in Delta. Attention. Dr. Braddock, please yeah, report to Environment to Management Office for Alpha. Just gonna download everything. I wanna be part of everyone's Look, lives. Look, all I do is repair the when they blow. Look this way. Oh, it's the break room. Miller, you hear about Corporal Allen? Super. Oh, check it out. Turkey Hunter 3. God, this game looks good. Shit. This is an achievement for getting like 30,000 30, points on that or something. Pretty good game. I like that it's based on a true story. I found some PDA. Aww. We'll check that after we talk to the boss man. I'm going to ask him if I was you, man. I want to be a good Marine and be on time. You need to report to Sergeant Kelly ASAP. He's in command. This is Delta Science Management. We would like to request. Marine HQ, let me in. Took his sweet time, Marine. Oh, damn it, I took too long. Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I like I want you to check the out the old ranking commission com facility. We heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. Program this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. I hope you follow the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. You'll pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. I love the sentries. Look at them. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. 
Now move out. Can I hurt him a little? Come on, dude. You never let me hurt anyone. Bro, oh, Mars really does just look like a meatball, doesn't it? I can eat this place. Hi, Century. You might have to look at my tablet. This is the first PA I found. General Access Security Killings. What is that? This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Bernache, dated November 10, 2145. I fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, okay. I the heard whispering. When I went to investigate the sounds, I found nothing. Check the work logs, and I was the only person scheduled to be in that What's area. Wrong with him? That experience, oh, okay. coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over in the Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off, the mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. That's I'm always expecting somebody faces. to jump out at me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage Attention cabin next UAC to the maintenance personnel. elevator. Technicians should use credits. cabinet code Volunteer 396 to access them. 396. saw some strange creatures or something down in Delta. He said it wasn't human. What? You can't believe anything that guy says. That's Just crazy. tell me that's what he said. It's not I human, though. Well, I like how the robot comes back looking for me if I just go the wrong way. I have the audio log. It's gonna be difficult to keep track of all this. Can I go home? Oh no. The UAC cares about the quality of life of its employees. Please take advantage of our quality medical care services. Can you guys give me access cards? I need them. Alright, fine, fine, fine. Let's go. I feel like we explored everywhere. The access cards aren't here, not yet. Make sure you recharge. I'll handle everything. Aha! What is it? Uh, three, six, nine? No. Listen to Adam Lambert's audio log. Okay, fine. Even though I missed it all. Again. This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Wait, Bernays. Why can't I just write this stuff 10th, down? 2145. Like, you know I can have another I fixed from the now couplings on. on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, Jeez. however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Have a PDA real Shortly way. after finishing the first coupling adjustment, I distinctly heard whispering. When I went to investigate the sounds, whispering? I found nothing. I checked the work logs, and I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. That experience, coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over in the Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off, the mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. I'm always expecting someone to jump out at me. I'll jump I've out secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance elevator. Technicians should use cabinet code 396 to access them. End of log. Dope. I got bullets. That's the broken modulator. It's my broken modulator now. Alright, well. And go up there. What's in here? Can't go in there either. Lisa. Mars City Underground. Varsity Sublevel is one of the first multi-purpose installations built on Mars, housing storage, environmental systems, localized energy production, and a bunch of other stuff you don't need to know about. Never mind. Hi. Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Most unexciting place on Mars. <laughs> You're gonna be I'm gonna need wrong you to grab some armor while. and secure your pistol before I can pass you through security. Can I get a SARF on shotgun okay, too? Okay, grab your gear. Now you're ready for combat. Let me do a radio test. Mars sec radio check. Excellent. Good signal. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. 
Just follow the main passage through the underground junction, then straight out. We'll have quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Okay, you're all set. Sounds good to me. Oh yeah, keep in mind, civilians are working down here. Don't get excited and shoot at Can I shoot some? down this way in quite some time. Welcome to the dungeon, brother. You sure are curious, aren't you? <laughs> What's this do? <laughs> it's just gonna... Let's go all the way down. to find him. You see... Uh, uh, never mind. Come on. Tell me. Don't listen to me. Never mind what I said. Come on, see, Rogers. Lay it on me, brother man. You have armor shards in this corner over here. What's up with that? Is that proper storage of armor? I shouldn't talk about it. It's really not my business. It's, yeah, I'm gonna get the information. I shouldn't away. talk about it. Right, fine, he just repeats himself. What a goofy goober. Listen, Scotty. I've done this a million times. It's not that hard. Why don't you crawl your fat ass down here and do it yourself? Because I'm getting paid to make yeah, sure you Fry, do it. come on. Just help him. buddy. Don't know if I can really help you with anything. I'm kinda busy here. Maybe it's us? Hey, what the hell's going on up there? <laughs> so Ray mysteriously died and exploded into goo. I think I might be a demon. Wow, the pods. Goo. No, wrong combination. Does PDA know about this thing? Grant, general access. Dang. This is Grant Baston, the environmental services supervisor. Date is October 19th. Favor. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some uh, unexplainable things. Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky, so we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. <laughs> I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually shorthanded. You think Someone's that's reporting scary? in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation, and we'll continue to log reports as I get them. He didn't tell me the Glocker combination. What? Uh, 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 uh. Okay, we're gonna have to come back. Uh, Glocker 023. Someone's gotta know. Is that doing what it's supposed to do? You maintenance guys not keep any of these machines running? Yes, sir. It's just that the science team demands a lot out of these things. Enough excuses. Just do your job and get the science team what they need. Well, I'm doing everything, but I just can't explain some of the things Rar that are happening to the systems. It's weird. Just get it done. It's weird, though, bro. Hey, let me in. Security. What do all these things mean? Jeez! <laughs> do you make a habit of sneaking up on people? Yes. Everyone's already on edge down here with all the strange things that have been going on. Come on, tell the me about it. The garage area is right through that door. Now stop bothering me. 
Fine. Gee, Sinclair. I thought you were cool. My flashlight's illuminating this place. Touch things. Can you imagine if I said things like that in real life? Come on, bro. I'm a toucher and a squeezer. Don't make this weird. Thanks for the bullets, by the way. Alright, I'll get in there. Cycle the airlock. Come on. Screaming. I don't know if there's any more out here. I <laughs> haven't just in time, we have like one second left. What's some armor shard there though? Is my heart ever gonna calm down? just lives inside my throat now. Everyone just get used to it. Marine, this is Sergeant Kelly. Oh, okay. You need to double time it down there. It Search the your assigned area and haul your ass back to Mars City. Out. It was the heart radio. That's what the problem was. <laughs> the radio is hard. was excited, not mine. Come on, let me in. A whole lot of Mars happening over here, am I right, guys? Huh? No, no, please. You must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. I can't let... I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. This cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God! I can't hold these levels. We're losing it! No problem. Oh god, this is intense. I remember actually being creeped out for some of play this. Oh god. Is that normal? Oh god. Turning my friends into freak jobs. No. Oh god. He's turning into a demon. What the music that you do? Dodge. You okay? Whoa! Shot on my friend. He's shooting me. All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We're under attack by an unknown enemy force. Fall back to Marine HQ to regroup. Who are they, sir? They're eating them, Sarge. And they're gonna eat me. I say me. again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. Do I have to? Can I stay here and help from this uh, facility? I'm trying to see if there's like collectibles. They're turning into zombies, Sarge. They're not the fun kind that you hear about in the news. Why does it sound like the doctor laughing? found a PDA that helps. Okay, where you're not supposed to go. Space.
say what you don't do. <laughs> don't freak out when panels explode on you. Squad leader, give sit reps. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. All the Marines are dead, son. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Power system's down at sun level. Backup and life support systems only. We've got lots of civilian casualties. Success! Yes. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area. Science. Oh god. He broke my fences. He won't break my flashlight fences. What are you doing there? Don't you know he's a marine? Well, this is a bunch of stuff that's not supposed to happen, guys. Frames. Report directly to Marine seconds. Headquarters seconds. and await further orders. Go ahead. You know what, while you're doing that, I'm gonna come over here. <laughs> Stick your hand through again. Oh god, they're tough. Alive. I wish their toughness level was like more coherent because he seemed to take a lot of bullets. I hit him all kinds of ways. Some of these guys just take a lot of bullets, man. Some of these guys are built for tough. Mars for tough. Come on. Did you have a PDA? Are you real? Got armor shards at least. Here. There's something up here. Whoa, careful. Let me in. Ah. Armor shards and health kits, huh? Nice suit. What's happening, Sarge? All the civilians are turning into mysterious skeletons. Ooh, a PDA. How do I get up there to get that stuff? Solutions. All right, before we do anything, let's listen to this PDA, huh? Maybe we'll learn something. Frank, <laughs> you crazy guy. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production, dated October 18th, nice. 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel to keep up with demand. 
The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain our equipment. Okay, I don't know what's going on with the Delta, but I'm doing all I can down here. The constant demands are bad enough, but the rumors going around are making things a whole lot worse. And I gotta tell you, things don't get better soon. All hell is gonna get worse. I do not like coming down here. What are these guys doing down here? Starting med kits and shards, huh? Look me out a little bit. Uh huh. More secrets back here, huh? I'm on top of the pipe. Oh, oh, oh. Sometimes this game just looks like a butcher golf pick, you know what I'm saying? That looks like that if you go down there, though. Beeping this loudly. Beep at me. Is there a button I have to push? Hmm. I pushed the door behind me that was beeping at me. 
near me. Where? Information. Also, did he did he ever fix this machine he was working on? I'm guessing no, right? anything about this one? Oh, hold on, this freak's here. Ow! God, bless it. Will you die? Someone died. This is the last one we got. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager of Science to Call Production, dated October 18, 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel to keep up with demand. The constant and increasing load from the Delta Complex is causing havoc. We are going to start losing critical systems if we have to sustain these levels much longer. I request clearance to requisition parts from other departments in order to maintain our equipment. Okay, I don't know what is going on over in Delta, but I'm doing all I can down here. The constant demands are bad enough, but the rumors going around are making things a whole lot worse. And I gotta tell you, if things don't get better soon, all hell is gonna break loose. Coincidentally. Oh, they didn't have information on that panel at all. Did he drop something? Meet this guy? No? Now you can go in there. No. Right. All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We don't know what we're up against. Repeat, we have negative ID on the assailant. Establish a strong hold and keep them at bay. Dead fire her. Wow, that fire hurt a lot too. Well, son of a 
bitch. I guess I'm the bad guy here, huh? I missed something then. Spawn on us. Rocket shells I missed. Shotgun shells in his little cubby hole where he spawned. Oh, actually, I never went down here, did I? Please, PDA? No, shells though. Wasn't useless. Yeah, I really wish I could change the FOV. I feel like I'm kind of like sucked in forwardly. You know what I mean? I should look that up. Armor shards, shotgun shells. This guy's dead. That's not good. Well, plus, I backtracking does help refill my health. There's no PDA or anything hidden up here. There's that health and armor. This big armor. Oh, well, some of my health disappeared now. That's... All damage is real, now we know. That wasn't that far either, so we gotta be careful. Oh, can't be that low here. If we go down there, that's death. It has to be. Oh, 
techno stuff that's broken. Just can't help but feel like there's a PDA laying around here that I just straight up missed. You know what I mean? Went up there. Got up there. Hear someone dying. We're trapped over there. Combination of the two. <laughs> Come on, guys. I'm not playing the game legit. They don't make me look stuff up. I'll do it too. I don't have things like pride. Wrapping around and reveals the code. Well, it does feel like we're, we go very far away from it to backtrack to go unlock it. Unless it's the exact same code as the other locker. Would well, that be weird, right? <laughs> what was the other code? Something, something. Lambda fish hook man. Oh, this is where the door broke. Our <laughs> shards down here. Man, when we crouch, we can really crouch. I gotta give it that though. Looks like death if we're not careful. Okay, let's let's save and see what happens if we go back there, huh? Yeah, we can custom name the save too. Look at that. Save here. Mars City Butter. Kill me quite quickly, gonna be honest with you. Oh, I can't even go in there. Damn. Yeah. Hoping it'd be something important. No PDA over here. This is it. I'm just gonna look it up. Actually, before we look it up, let's listen to see if it was literally the exact same code. Who was it? This guy? This is the audio log of maintenance technician Adam Bernays, dated November 10th, 2145. 
I uh, fixed the couplings on the heat shields this morning with no problems. I did, however, have another odd experience while I was down there. Shortly after finishing the first coupling adjustment, I distinctly heard whispering. When I went to whispering investigate whispers. the sounds, I found nothing. I checked the work logs, and I was the only person scheduled to be in that area today. That experience, coupled with the stories I've heard from some guys over in the Delta Labs, has me pretty freaked out. I'm really beginning to hate going down to the underground maintenance area. The people down there are a bit off, mumbling, the weird looks. The whole place is just plain creepy. I'm always expecting someone to jump out at me. I've secured my tools and the busted modulator in the storage cabinet next to the maintenance area. Can I listen to it carefully? Technicians should use tell. cabinet code 396. You're telling me that this one is the one that should have told me this the code. This is Grant Baston, your environmental services supervisor. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some uh, unexplainable things. Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky. So we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually shorthanded. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation, and we'll continue to log reports as I get them. Oh, there it is. It was in his emails. 531. Oh. Okay, so I did have it. Oops. It's important to remember to check the emails. Shotgun shells, basically, what was in there. All right, all right, I feel less bad now. I feel less guilty. So I just looked up where to find the code, and not the code itself. And they were like, dude, the PDN you got should already have it. You Nimrod. And all of a sudden, not that smart. How do we get over there? Because I see that the door is open. Can I leave? Back to Marine HQ and await further orders. One thing I did like is I remember that the security group will give me that. Get the machine gun a little bit earlier than usual. Won't get ammo for it for a while though. That's fine. I go for it, guy. So I don't even know if this is an actual secret. Saves. Glad to go and above beyond the call of duty. Damn. It looked like I could though, right? It looked like it's right there. Maybe not from up here. I was pulling down the run. Take a decent amount of fall damage. Damn, that's 
it's right there, I think. I think it's right there. Call me crazy. Probably not, I don't know. I won't try too many times. I promise. As soon as it becomes weird. Let me get over there. That door is unlocked. Why'd you leave it unlocked if you didn't want me to try? I feel like you go fast enough. I feel like it's right there. Get up. Which quick load thing worked? So you can make it. You have to land on the other side. You have to land over there. I wonder. Separate save. No way. It's broken. cells and a health terminal are over here but nothing else so you're trapped over here are you not are you supposed to come over here before this thing breaks is that why As cool as that is, <laughs> make that the head cannon. That's what the story actually ends. I get trapped on the other side of that cross. You can't get those plasma cells, unfortunately. You have to live without. Oh God! Jesus, do you have to run out like that? A freak. Did not remember the dude in the elevator. Not gonna lie. Completely forgot about elevator dude. All remaining Marine units. This is Sergeant Kelly. I am unable oh, to fair. reach Mars City fair. from my current position. 
Move to Marine HQ to regroup and await further orders. Here I was worried. Mars City. Things are getting weird. You up here. Quickly. I thought I was the only one still alive. I can't believe I found you. Don't worry, Spike. Something got gotcha. you. I don't know what it is. It was like a shock wave. It, it passed through the entire base. It started changing. It was crazy. I, I was working up here on the vent shafts. I don't know how I survived. For help. Please. Can I no way. I'm staying up here. It's the only safe place. All right. You can't get me down. I'm staying here. Okay. Do you say anything else? Hurry back with some help. I don't want to stay up here alone. Talk one more time. You can't get me down. Okay. I'm staying here. That's fine. I'm sure you'll be all right. Be careful. I don't know what's in there. Can you tell me what it's not? <laughs> Something stronger than my shotgun. I'm gonna look up the control, see if there is a way to make toggle crouch. Get me a nice toggle crouch going. Oh, this way. Uh-oh. Bloody messes. Uh-oh, breathing in my ear. Something special right there? No, nothing? Just tricks you into thinking the vent continues when it doesn't? This panel's open. Where? Behind me! All the almond shards for himself turned into a damn demon. The bloody place was he doing down there? Marcus Stranton. All right, now we gotta look more thoroughly. Now we gotta know. Marcus Stranton, your user email. What you get in your emails, Marcus? These ones on Mixum have none again. Requisite to crate jackhammers. Oh my god, we got chainsaws instead, huh? What do you do? <laughs> Chainsaws serve a um, purpose on Mars. I get one of those chainsaws, and man, does it serve a purpose for me. Well, well, for now, while here on Mars, I'm pressing my life up, up, I miss you terrible. I'll join the Mars City drink tomorrow. Evening show leaves first thing, 1116. I'm leaving. Very well for now. Any idea who this guy is? I think he may have been the funny looking dweeb from Alpha Labs. <laughs> they don't even know who he is. It's, it's sad. No, I'm due to for well until next time. Oh. Why? Marcus, no. Okay. Undocumented cargo. This is Mark Stanton, manifest controller currently stationed at Mars City. I'm not sure who to send this to, so I decided to send it to quite a few people. If you're on the recipient list, please take a moment to review this report. It is quite important. I'm very concerned over the shipping procedures out here. I am the Manifest Controller, and as such, I need to be informed of everything coming in and out of Mars City. Someone here is subverting my position and preventing me from getting data on things being shipped. This is unacceptable. Not only does this reflect poorly on my upcoming review, but this is my job and I'm tired of being out of the loop. I have no idea who keeps telling the shipping crews to allow things in and out without allowing me to produce or procure the manifest. But whoever it is, it must stop. Also, oh, who keeps one of the on dock deleting workers the manifest? actually told me to piss off when I tried to stop one of the last containers from going straight to Delta. I immediately filed a report and will follow up with the transit manager next time I see him. Alright. End of log. Think you're cool, don't you, him? Ooh, I got the key card. Nice, nice, dude. And assault rifle ammunition. Some of these, not gonna lie, some of the color choices. Now that I think about it, now that I'm looking at it, the metals, the uh, 
the teals and cyans, the beiges. Reminds me a lot of Fear One. As soon as I saw the computer and that phone right there, I was like, oh man. Command HQ, this is Specialist Wilson. My team is gone. They're all dead. I'm running blind. What are my orders? Over. Be cool. Specialist Wilson, this is Sergeant Kelly. Stay sharp, son. Move to your last known army and fortify your position. We'll find you. Sometimes being aggressive is all these demons know. Hey, little buddy. He's here. He's helping. Go get him. Love that guy. I love those little drones. Probably the best friends you could ever have in a game series. Do it for her. Mars of the way. UAC. I believe in UAC. I'm doing my part. Bunch of straggler boys. Alright, get together. Two for one special. Might as well. Oh! Where was your secret compartment, Captain Capel? Not enjoy that freight job. Where did you come from? Slimy freight job? Spawned in, huh? Oh, there's at least a one more in here. Can I bust this open? No? It looks so bustable. Where are you? There you are. <laughs> there you are. Come over here. Headless freak. Right, it's over there with the green. Door. No. Damn space demons. They ruined Mars City. I'll leave that armor there for now. This is inside the labs I couldn't get into earlier. Well, I'm gonna have to pick up that man and get that clip of ammo. Come on, don't lock the station, bro. Gotta be thorough. Door's a little broken. I don't wanna leave a PDA anywhere that I might need. They're integral to the plot now. You all remember that. How you doom. Nice try, Sally Jesse Raphael. Hiding in here with the riffraff and the shards, I see, huh? The demon and the possessed soldiers are working together. I don't like that. Uh -huh. Well, they're very dead in here. That's news to me. security cabin here. Doors locker 17. What do you know about storage locker 17? Ooh, there's PDA right here. Patient attack, reports. Let's look at his emails real quick. Um, thank you for sending an audio report. I wish the news better. Da 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 da. Gonna appreciate you including the code in your report. It will be. Oh, okay. So it is in the report of the patient attack. Leaving. Mark. No worries. Hope that. Uh, so absence. Is there anything I should do? Okay. Go back to this. Uh, this is uh, this one for 
Mars Audio log for Dr. Kaysen, currently stationed at Mars City. I have just left the weekly status meeting here in medical. The most prominent topic was the vast number of psychological issues we are seeing as of late. It's awesome. The number of reports indicates that 10% of the overall base personnel have shown symptoms. As many people will not come in for this type of thing, the number of affected personnel could truly be in the 30 to 40% range. It has even manifested itself here in medical. We uh, have several nurses and a couple of good doctors out for related reasons. I'm going to formally request two additional psychiatrists on the next shuttle from Earth. The two we have are being overworked, and the content of their sessions with patients is starting to affect them as well. Keep on leaving Dr. the Casey cola around. The Robo Diet Cola. All right. Now for the PDA code. Patient attack. Dr. Mark Casian. 1547. Patient Jonathan Wills was admitted after complaining of insomnia and nausea. According to the nurse, Mr. Wills was calm and exhibited no signs of disorder when he was brought to exam room 5. However, by the time I reached him at 10 after 4, his personality had changed dramatically. When I entered the room, Mr. Wills lunged at me with a scalpel he apparently stole from a supply drawer. A with the assistance of an orderly, we managed to subdue and sedate him without injury. Mr. Wills was heavily medicated and could not be diagnosed, but in the 20 minutes he was left unattended, he managed to carve three symbols in his arm and cut his own tongue into two halves. I, I can only guess at the cause of his problems. I hope that additional psychiatrists arrive soon. In the meantime, in response to this assault, all medical supplies and armaments will be locked in a secure hospital cabinet with the code 347. Dr. Casey and I. Shotgun shells and machine gun ammo. Nice. Can't save since we're doing so good. Um, butter two is our main save from now on. Yes. No. <laughs> Bad patient. Dude was faceless earlier. Okay. Right, you want to save those pieces for later, that makes sense. Suckers are dead, man. Is that a head? Or a helmet? <laughs> Broken. Ooh, I got Billy Tyson's PDA, though. Hello? You wanna fight me through this cracked doorway? Is there any way to avoid the fire? I forgot if there was a valve I could have shut off. It's fine, taking a little bit of damage. Oops, wrong button. Billy, what do you got? Staff Sergeant Tyson putting sentry butts in routine patrols. If the ammo had been loaded, the Marine would have been killed. Thankfully, the other Marine was able to mobilize it quickly. The sentry butt is powerful, maybe too powerful. We need to much fire up on the Mars City. I started about before something worse happened. So, sentry bot did a daily down. We have new troops inbound. Replace Al, and you'll be arriving on the next transport. Be sure the manifest kill uh, filled out and first issued. Blah, blah, blah. Due to the upcoming personnel transfer, we will be changing the weapon storage code in Marine Command 584. The change will be take effect. Okay. So, there's a storage. We gotta get to Marine Command, because 584 is the code we got from this Billy Kelly. Bill Tyson. Let's see. General Troop Morale. Audio report on Troop Morale. Morale here is beginning to drop. 
It's nothing to worry about yet since I keep my Marines sharp and ready to go. But events at the base are wearing on the troops. There have been a lot of things happening here on the base. I believe the UAC experiments being performed here must be the cause. Out here, they could be experimenting on God knows what. There are quite a few people missing. And no Marines, of course. It's the civilian population I am referring to. Bottom line, whatever it is they have going on here has my men on a razor's edge. At this point, there is no cause for alarm, but I am requesting we rotate squads every 90 days instead of every 180. I will continue to report as the situation develops. It is good we have the new Marines en route. Fresh faces will help. Sergeant Tyson, out. 584. 584, let's listen to this new one. Audio report confirming new troop deployments for the Mars City Marine Facility, October 30th, 2145. The new troops will be arriving within a few days. I've started a series of training exercises focusing on close quarter small weapons combat, as well as instituting mandatory refresher courses on all munitions nice. and weapons in our armory. In response to the large number now, of security yeah. breaches and general feelings of ill will around the base, I've doubled security details, placing two Marines at each checkpoint. This additional presence should help calm things down. I expect that the incoming requested. Marines are not quite as green as the last appointment. They've turned requested. out okay, but some combat experience Video will go a long way right now. Sergeant okay. Tyson, out. Guys are showing up, but they're green, basically. Video link up requested. All right, I'm just going to save again, right here, just in case. I should probably switch to the quick save ability, which is. Oh. Link up yes. requested. Okay. Connection established. Marine. Sarge. I can't believe you're still alive. I'm good at my job, Sarge. I'm able to return to Mars City. All passages out of the Delta complex have been blocked. <laughs> Can I close I'm setting it? up a command post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head toward Alpha Labs. It's mm -hmm. the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good job, and good luck, Marine. Thank you, sir. Well, I dare say it's the best good luck I've ever had. Run up with Bravo team. We never do join up with them if I'm referring to them. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Where do I go now? Okay, he's over there. The chain gun's defending them. Can't get over there, though. What was that? Enemy respawn? Will you die? God, oh, they take a lot of bullets. Come from. This is the infirmary. It's backtracking right here. Why did he spawn down here? I guess just to surprise me. Because I assume this is the door that opens down, right? Yes. Anything work on Mars? I was in there earlier. <laughs> getting behind the backdrops, getting warm. Oh man. Form a queue if you want food. They didn't raid the snack machine though. 
Marine, if you run across any operational sentry bots, use them. Those guys pack a lot of firepower. I'm trying to interrupt my game with Chicken Puncher. God. <clears throat> oh, it's out of order! <clears throat> now I feel bad. Hammer! Do you have the one thing I was living for? The stupid Mars! The phones are indestructible here. How can I ever find peace? The UAC is here to help you. Psychological services are free and confidential. What? Classic. Come get it. Come get it. Ow! What a jerk. I hate that freak lead move. It's like I did something to him. Oh, there's a foot in the toilet. That's gonna cause a clog. Oh, and that's a huge turd. Yeah, there, it's a potato. The marine found out how to flush. Come on now. At least there's not a turd in the urinal. urinal. Then I have to call someone. I'd, I'd report that, even though we're getting invaded by demons right now, I'd be like, I'd call my sword right now. But hey. <laughs> someone took a deuce in the urinal during the freaking demon invasion? I'm upset. I'm gonna take a leave of absence. Uh, I need some time. I'm gonna go home and rethink, rethink our situation. Here. Hey! Oh god! Another enemy. Hey! Hey, buddy! Hi! I'm gonna backtrack from where you came from, if you don't mind. Okay. I'm the fat guys only show up after the demon invasion. You know, notice that? It, oh, I thought there was a PDA you get back here after he dies. Right? Oh, I love that little robot. I love the little beeping sounds he makes. Come on, let me in, man. The door's unlocked behind this door. Is there a vent? Green. You gotta get to Bravo team quickly. They need all the firepower they can get. Lord Sidious. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. For Lord Sidious. Promised us peace. Also, where the freak? Oh, there was, I thought there was a secret back here. I could have swore. Maybe I'm wrong. I thought there was a way in there, little buddy. Don't be mad at me. I know you want to get back to murdering. What's this? What? What's this? It's nothing. It's nothing and never was anything. God bless it. Alright, alright, I'm with you. I'm with you this time. And no more distractions. Come on. Keep on doing your thing. Growing me while he shoots them, that's good. So they're not shooting at him. I don't think there's anything here though. Bullets, not head kit. Oh. You guys have a whole lot of nothing. I hear you. What? Who did that? Glowy red thing, nothing. I know. Authorized personnel on file, Duncan Matthews. We need to find Duncan Matthews, brother man. Is he over here? Duncan! Is he gonna 
throw that barrel? We interrupted that, didn't we, little buddy? Yeah, take a break. Take a little break. Oh, they have the little connecting terminals. Flip up and look at. There's a vent. And you guys, Duncan Matthews. Little robot friend. All right, come on. Matthews, I knew it was you, your old dog. Let's see what you had to say for yourself, huh? <clears throat> that one. Gravity. Duncan! Emails, first of all. But well, for now, I'm Duncan. I'm not gonna stick around for this nonsense. Hey, look at my Rocky about me. Equipment request. Da, 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 da. UAC HR. Immediately, da, 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 around the base, make it easier for yourself. Why don't you, you crazy kook? No audio files. Oh, interesting. I literally, li literally just need him to get through that door. Where was that door? That wasn't the door, was it? No, it was this one. That guy was definitely not Duncan Matthews. I met him. You ain't him, brother man. You ain't him. That's it? Armor and machine gun ammo? I mean, it's not nothing. I guess. Might as well grab this health then. Reload and keep it reloaded. Okay. Quick save. And now activate the elevator. We're gonna go keep up with Bravo. Okay, <laughs> I was about to say. Is he in there? I'll start shooting. Alright, we made it. Here we are. Administration. It's looked better. You know what? We're gonna do a little cut right here. We did more than I thought we would right at the beginning of this game. But thank you all. I'm having a good time. It's been a long time since we went through this game. I don't remember everything. Hopefully you all enjoyed. But well, we're gonna do a little cut right here. Thank you all. You are Templar. Doom 3. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. We'll see you in the next episode. Y'all take it easy. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God! I can't hold these levels. We're losing it! No problem. Oh god, this is intense. I remember actually being creeped out for some of